Hi guys, Mogasal154 here and today we are gonna play Dream Island Tycoon and we are gonna see what all I, I made and I just finished this entire game in 1.5 days that is like a whole record so yeah so let's check out uh, so let's check out what I made and I have joined this game is one of my uh, favorites and I'll never stop playing this game because uh, Wenzel Studios is always coming up with new updates every like one week so I have a lot to make so every one week whenever he launches I just pay a visit to this game and I make all the new stuff so this is one of my uh, latest ones this is my swimming pool you can just swim around you know and this is my resort with the restaurant the grill and all you know uh, these are my rooms Over here, which are pretty basic, and I've got some more at the bottom too. This game is pretty great, like it's about a year old, and it's great. It has some bugs though but those can be fixed easily and I'm sure uh, Wenzel Studios has been working on it and these automatically opening doors is sort of creepy for people like me who are sort of scared of ghosts and all you know And actually, some trivia for you guys. These paintings are actually made by Wenzel Studios to put on. They were made, they have taken a picture of and, you know, posted on this game. So, this is my resort. And I'll just take you guys to my travel agency. And also if you have seen my previous video which is uh, about the tropical resort this one is much smaller and it is a little more reasonable depending on the prices because that one you have to pay 5000 or more on everything as soon as you start the game because in many tycoons you start from a very small price and then you increase to a, a, a really large one well, in, in that one it's a little unreasonable so I already told those complaints I don't know if it's gonna change it because I don't know because you know many of us have finished this game so now this is my travel agency is pretty great I spent a lot and lot of time making my airport which I'll just, which I'll just show in a bit the airport is sort of like a must see for all the airport lovers and if you're an airport lover you have to have to play this game because it's like 90% not ninety percent, but like s at least sixty percent airport. That's for sure.
so that there is my airport it's pretty big for an airport for a normal airport because you know well the differences between this one and the tropical resort are like um, what do you say they are this one is a little more elaborated on all those things except for the resort and many other things like this one is a, it's a little much larger and it's a lot more better you know? so guys this is my airport restaurant and this is all the seating with the uh, what do you say with the soda machine and all which is pretty good detail then this these are the airport gates thankfully in games like this there are no glitches sort of very irritating and you just just go near a seat and just, just sit then this is one of the other airport gates the exit and I got some planes over there in the hangar and I'll just take you guys to the beach and the restaurant and all the other things over here are like they are, you can't fly to others tycoon while you are like how you can in the tropical resort but the, this uh, I played this before tropical resort and because of this I discovered it these games will be one of my favorites no matter what and this you collect money like this so yeah so that is my restaurant and now I'll just show you guys the beach So, this beach over here, and there's a lifeguard, and you can also really swim. It's pretty cool, and you can also swim. Which is again a glitch. It is a pay end to get yourself onto the swing, but it is great. So that is uh, all those. All, so that is my airport, travel agency, restaurant, beach, and now I'm gonna take you to the last part, which is the fish market. shop so this is my stock water I've got and this is my cashier 
and also one of the best parts of the uh, what do you say a tropical resort tycoon is that all those people who are working for you they also get a salary so all the money that is so you get a lot less money than you do in the store so and the reason is which i found out that uh fifth like 50 percent of the money is going to the people who are working for you and 50 percent is coming to you for your use so that is one of the best parts of uh dream uh, of tropical resort and also i think dream island should also do that because like it's sort of great because you then you relate a lot to everyday life so that is dream island tycoon so i'll catch you later guys bye